Hey, what's going on you guys? This is Chaos Lord David. Welcome back to our Let's Play of Spyro, Year of the Dragon. So we've got to do the uh, Sparks level here in the Midnight Mountain home, so let's get started. Just before you kick the sorceress's big, fat, ugly butt, she built a factory to make robotic bugs to fight Sparks. But I don't think they're any match for him. <laughs> you said it very well there, Zoe. <laughs> so enter Bugbot Factory Bonus World? Yes. Like I said, I've always loved that comment from Zoe. That's well said from her. <laughs> Alright, so this is the last Sparks level here in the game, and this one could be a bit tough. Okay, so... So hopefully this won't be too bad. So we got more of these... Oh, remember these, remember these guys from the uh, tutorial level? Yep, they're back. Funny how they're like... Oh, give me that. Give me that key. <laughs> Funny how I got the key, even though it looked like I didn't even touch it. Um, it's like, oh, they didn't really uh, use the Sparks levels that much to make uh, very, very fast enemies. It's like, oh, the only time they actually use the uh, fast enemies is, uh, in this, is in this Sparks level. And now they got mobile homes this time, so they're going to be quite difficult to get around. For it to deal with. Yep, here he is. These guys, these uh, mobile homes can be very annoying, too. Not to mention they can uh, send out guys, but uh, they can move also, of course. Give me that key. Okay, I just want to make sure. I'm going to have to leave that butterfly here, just to make sure. And I, yeah, these green guys suck, too. Sit down. Whoa, 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 whoa. These guys just kind of, those bugs just came out of, like, came out of nowhere. Bugs out of nowhere! Bugs out of nowhere! And good thing that one doesn't move. And here's a shield. Awesome. I think I just ate two butterflies at once. <laughs> it's like, bug out of nowhere! Uh, where's, like, a... Uh, it's surrounded by a force field. Rats. Well, I may as well take what, take care of what bugs I can get. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I have always hated those green ones. Give me that key. Sometimes I wish the keys would be like colored so you know which one to go to go to. Yeah, it's that one. Okay, good. I got him. I was gonna say um, you may want to keep your distance as soon as you. Uh, uh, try to open the gate, because that mobile home will come screaming out. Come, well, it will come screaming out as soon as you open it. Uh, not that way. Not that way. Oh! That one just came out of nowhere. <laughs> Bug out of nowhere! <laughs> I do believe it opens these. Yeah. More mobile homes. Oh, and that lowered the force field, too. May as well go ahead and uh, take this chance to get the gems. Now that the, now that the uh, force field's gone, and yes, a uh, green butterfly. You can at least save that for later. Oh, give me that. I'm going to save that for the boss. Because I know for a fact that the boss is pretty tough, so I'm going to want to save it. <laughs> Funny how these uh, bugs uh, match colors too. Oh yeah, another red thing. <laughs> a lot of things that kind of uh, match the colors here. Hey man, you're going the wrong way. You're going the wrong way, man. Oh good, I did not get hit. I thought I actually did get touched by that bug. There he is. Alright, we're just about to the boss. Uh, dang it, I want to save the butterfly just in case. Oh yeah, these guys. They, I hate these guys so much. These guys are so, so annoying. So I'll just have to like, hug a wall and just hit them like this. Alright. Get all these bugs! Get all these bugs! Yeah, that was ridiculous. Is he still you? Thank you. Knew I probably should have taken care of those ones on the right. 
Whoa, whoa, whoa. And here's the last uh, uh, gem right here inside this mobile home. Awesome. Give me the key. So we got all uh, uh, 200 gems here. Give me the key. And uh, good thing I saved that butterfly over here. All right, full health. All right, we're, we're ready. We're good now. Let's do this. All right, final boss. I'm telling you, this thing just molests the boss. It's always useful to try and keep it. Keep it for the boss fight. This thing just molests. Oh, there he is. Yeah, there we go. Annabelle. Alright, we are completely done with the Sparks levels. And that means we got all four uh, Sparks power-ups, too. I mean, it's like, look at all these bugs right here. This is like, no way. That can't be happening. This cannot be true. <laughs> How could our boss be defeated so easily? This, 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 is, this is BS. <laughs> this is not, this is shenanery. That last egg must have had some extra magic, because it gave Sparks two new abilities. Now he can break open treasure chests, and using the Atlas, he can warp you to any level. Just select the level you want, and press the square button. Now those two abilities are quite useful also. Because if, if there are any gems that you're missing from any other levels, and if you don't want to just go to the portal, you can just go right to it straight away using the Atlas. Very useful. And uh, since uh, Sparks can actually open treasure chests, you don't have to uh, always uh, try to go over and uh, break them yourself. But hey, look here, it's Zoe. She wasn't here before. This portal has been sealed with the strongest magic I've ever seen. You'll need all the dragon eggs and all the gems from each world to break the seal. Well, if we look at our stuff here... We got 7,000 gems and 148 eggs. So we're just one egg away and 8,000 treasure away. Hmm. Sounds intriguing. So we'll have to go over here and look who is here! It's the fat bear himself. And uh, this right, this coming up has got to be probably the best moment to ever... One of the best moments in this entire game. Behold the gloriousness that is about to ensue. Don't worry, Spyro. I won't be needing any more of your money. Now, now, don't look so surprised. I found one of the dragon eggs and I'm going to sell it for a fortune back in Avalar. Uh... Uh-oh. Uh, why are you looking at me like that? <laughs> I, uh, 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 I, I've got to be going now. Uh, toodles. Yeah, remember that your day is coming, Moneybags? Well, that day has come, baby. Yes. Time to get the, time to let the gems rain, baby. It's rain and gems. Hallelujah. It's rain and gems. <laughs> and I just, it's just fascinating to just attack the living heck out of Moneybags to get your, to get the gems that you paid for the entire game and get them back. Nothing more satisfying in the in the in moment in this game than almost anything any other game that I've ever played. I've always loved this moment, and uh, he doesn't actually escape into uh, where he's trying to go to in Avalar. He'll always run in the circle pattern. Of course, if you try to get him the other way, he'll run the other direction. We just gotten all about gotten all the 8,000 gems, so it's pretty close. So any time now, there it is. Oh wait, one more. Come here! No! Drat! Double drat! Drat, 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 drat! Oh, I never knew dragons were so fast! That's it, I give up. I'm retiring to Spooky Swamp to become a haiku poet. Yeah, told you that you get the ass kicking of a lifetime, money bags. Ow! Hi, Al. Yeah, you better run. You better run, money bags. Go into go into the Crystal Islands like the pussy you are. <laughs> All right. So uh, once again, if we look at our stuff here, we got the 149 eggs and the 15,000 treasures. So we're gonna go right back towards that secret portal. See, so we're only at 10 minutes. So I'm actually gonna do the uh, secret port, the uh, secret level for the last part. Even though I do apologize to it being a super short part, but I like to, you know keep things short from this point forward so there it is the super bonus round has been unlocked but that's gonna be the next part all right so now we have all 100 the 149 uh, 
eggs and the uh, uh, 15,000 gems. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna do the uh, super bonus round, which is the only thing that we've got left to do in this game. It's the uh, secret level to get the uh, last uh, egg and uh, the last bit of treasure and uh, whatever else is in store here. So I hope you guys enjoyed this part of our Let's Play of Spyro Year of the Dragon, and I'll see you guys in the last part. I'll talk to you guys later. Take it easy.